Hey my demigods, what's going on? So we're through the Olympian, and today for you guys, I'm here with... The 14th Olympian. Alright, took you long enough. Um, today for you guys, <laughs> we're gonna be doing 3.18 patch notes, Rising Flames. Um, uh, a booster pack of... Uh, what? I, I thought it was a box opening. Nigga, this isn't Yu-Gi-Oh! <laughs> Hashtag Dueling Dragons! Uh, Alright, so shameless... Um, Advertising. Same, I forgot. Same how advertising. So we're gonna go over the patch notes with you guys. And uh, before we start, just wanted wait. To... Before we start, can we talk about the story we just had? All right. Sure. You know what? You you tell it since you were in the call. All right. All right. So my card wasn't working, so I called up the guy. Right. I was like, Hey, my card. Guy. The customer service guy. Right. He. I tell you not. If I was to meet Bruce Lee as customer service guy, I would meet this customer service guy. And Bruce Lee is my fucking idol. Right, so like, basically what happened was, my card wasn't working, so I called the customer service guy, I'm like, hey, my card isn't working, you know, I try to buy something on Smite, and it doesn't, doesn't work, he's like, alright, maybe we can help you, you know, buy, uh, I don't know if you're going to buy uh, skins and voice packs and whatnot, I go, yeah, yeah, okay, alright, five seconds pass, I'm like, Wait, did he just say skins and fucking voice? Do you play Smite, sir? He goes, yeah, me and no, it's so fucking hype. It was oh, funny. We got he was so like, hyped for the guy. <laughs> and he was just laughing guy. his ass off, bro. Yo, shout out to the customer service guy. Give him a raise. I want a raise. Uh, if, yeah, if his boss is watching, they gotta give him a raise. He was the most <laughs> lit guy ever. Bro, I would... He's some guy I would take fucking clubbing. Just cause. Guy I would take to bed. All right. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> back, back uh, to the uh, patch notes. Patch notes. All right. So before we begin, um, quick shout out to these new skins. Usually we don't go over skins, but uh, this Naja skin, pretty hot looking. Not gonna lie. Um, basically takes away all the controversy by him being a girl. Uh, mm -hmm. that's, that's that's the big thing I have to say about that. Uh, Monster trainer Arlong Shen. Uh, way to rip off uh, Pokemon, but I still want it because. Wait! 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 Can we can we play what Lord Fire Lord Naja says? Sure. How triggered are you right now? How triggered are you right now? Uh, I'm not sure if it's gonna come up with the recording. If it doesn't, I apologize. But um, hopefully it does, because honestly, that's like the greatest thing I've ever seen mm -hmm. in my entire life. And then Clockwork Knight, Arlong Alquang. Who cares about that? God cards, achievements, to the crowd, Naja, whatever. Oh, okay. So item changes. Oh, alright, alright, you start. Alright, so the first item change is Hydra's. So now it has an additional, like, thing to its passive. It increases MP5 by 2.5% per 10% of your missing maximum mana, and it increases from 30 to 40, which means you're welcome, Loki mains. Shout out to Professor Loki, because <laughs> this is your item now. This... There's no reason, there's no reason not to buy Hydra's Lament. Yeah, this um, is gonna be a big change. Um, yeah. Like pretty, who else? Who else uses like hydras? I mean, I know some assassins. You kind of build it like, but that's like situational if you're like really far ahead. Like uh, Loki, you build it on, and you build it on. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's Loki. <laughs> Isn't that it? <laughs> yeah, I think hydra is just meant for Loki. Like, this is like just meant for him. But, I, mean, <laughs> I think I've seen it on a few like a wheelishes from time to time, but that's about it. Yeah. Reinforced Greaves. Oh, wait, is that you? It doesn't really matter. <laughs> I know. We'll, we'll make it you, alright? So, Reinforced and Reissues are the same thing, so just do yeah. both of them. But basically, just getting a really big nerf after last patch, because last patch, they got new passive, um, they got reworked, they got added power, I believe, and added health, um, and added CDR, or uh, CCR, so crowd... Cr what it says? Crowd control. What the heck? Uh, crowd control reduction. Um, so, now those are getting nerfed um they were really big for like a week here what didn't it, like the last patch come out, like a week ago yeah like i was expecting this patch a week late but uh or, like a week later because it's like two weeks but no they, they, they just got pretty quickly <laughs> um like so, reinforced shoes and reinforced greaves got hit pretty bad um yeah now look i'm looking at like big time it's like three five to threes per stack mm -hmm. so and a little ambiguous about this. Increased maximum stack count from 5 to... Oh! The oh, health reduce, too, from wrong. 150 to 75. Yeah, that cuts the health, 
health yeah. down by half. Disgusting. Um, I'll, I'm gonna just see to see. I, it's probably still gonna be pretty viable. Um, it's just it's not as big anymore. <coughs> People are still probably gonna be more inclined to go to uh, choose the focus. Or worried, Tabby. Yeah. Or Teleria, right? I mean, I don't know. Kind of, sort of. Fucking Teleria, disgusting. <laughs> you always tell me to get that on Aries, and I'm like, all right, I'll get it on Aries. You mean fucking not Teleria, you dumbass? Fucking uh. Traveler shoes. Travelers. <laughs> I was like, fucking, who uses <laughs> Teleria? <laughs> That's what I meant, not Teleria. <laughs> Alright. Jesus Christ, man. Alright. important. Next item. Goddamn. Void shield. <laughs> void shield. So, they made void shield a little bit more expensive. It should be 2700 overall. Mm-hmm. And they reduced its physical protections from 50 to 40. But, like, uh... I would still pick it up. Like, I personally don't pick it up that much anyway, but... This is more inclined, this is inclined me more, like, less and less to pick it up. Because I really didn't pick it up just because yeah. it was expensive at first, and now it's even more expensive. And it reduced physical protections, like, no thank you. So, like, personally, I really didn't even get protections on any of my assassins at all. Um, so, okay. this is just making it less appealing. Um, but I mean, for the mo people that are more, like, I don't know, more professional junglers, I guess, this they're probably still going to get it, but... I don't know. Like, Weekend, for example, will probably still get it, but... I don't know what I'm talking about. Alright, which played? <laughs> Disgusting. Just reduce physical protection from 60 to 50. Um, honestly, this isn't going to have too much of an effect. I think before it had, like, 40. Like, before the 60, it, became, it was 40, right? Yeah, and so they, they kind of bounced it out. Yeah, I mean, I usually still don't get it, unless I'm going at someone that's really attack speed heavy. Or I'm, unless I'm an Osiris. But other than that, like, which played... I, I don't see a huge change in it. Mm -hmm. It's making it less appealing. Um, God changes, so Agni. You want to start? Or... Oh, you said Ladies you first, start. so you start. I identify as a patch helicopter, actually. Oh, I identify as a customer service guy, but whatever. Shoutouts. <laughs> Alright, so Agni. His flame wave increased persistent time from flame wave of 0.5 to 1. Ooh. <laughs> This means it what takes. Does it, what does it mean, Shadow? <laughs> Please. Uh, I was hope. I was hoping you would go first, but fuck it. <laughs> I think this means that it takes longer for the flame wave to travel, so you can have more time to juke. All right. Honestly, I don't play Agni that much. If I'm being completely honest, um, that would probably make the most sense. Although I don't think Agni was a really broken god to begin with. He was just an odd. Wait, does see. it? Or does it last long? Is Flame Wave his dash? Um, I, I think it's just a big, like, Flame Wave that he just sends out. Is it... Yeah, and that's what I'm looking at. Is it his dash or his one? Oh, I, I think, think it's, it's like, dash. it does burn damage for a little bit when you're on fire, I think. Oh, that's his, his dash. dash, yeah. Okay, so his dash stays out for longer. That's what it does. Oh, that's what it is? Alright. Seems legit. Um, Chiron getting really nothing. Um... Yeah, he just, um... Just kind of a... I haven't experienced this glitch personally, but uh, this does sound kind of bad. Um, it's kind of unfair. Cupid, <laughs> my little lover boy. This uh, was my fucking turn, dickhead. Hey, I was just introducing it. All right, your turn. Right, Go. All right, all right. Love struck, right? So it has been adjusted to accommodate for the changes listed below. Changes listed below. Heart bomb. <laughs> they increase cooldown from 10 seconds to 12 seconds. But they increased the radiant radius for explosions from twenty to thirty, and added an FX to the heart bomb indicating the explosion. <coughs> so, what this means is, you can spread your you can spread your hearts around for longer, not longer, for m more people, I guess. And but I I usually just aim at a wall and make it confined. No, this is a. Uh... This is where, like, you know, you hit someone and, like, after a few seconds it goes off. Not like the... Oh, this isn't the share of the love. Okay. No, this is heart... Yeah, this is just... Okay, okay. My fault, my fault, yeah, my fault. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, so, Heart Bomb kind of buff nerf, but the buff outweighs the nerf then. Just because... 30 units, 12 seconds, I can, I can do that. Yeah, it's more damage output. Share the love no longer consumes love strucks, heart stacks. So no Which I think to. is really, really, really fucking good. Just because <laughs> fucking... I hated, like... Oh, 
I built 20 stacks for this heart bomb, but I'm really low on health. Let me share the love. Oh no, my stacks are gone, kind of thing. Like, come mm -hmm. on. Um, then we have Flutter, which no longer provides attack speed when cast, which kind of sucks, but provides a passive attack speed, you know, 4, 8, 12, 16, and 20. And the cooldowns are reduced, so that means you get away faster and more often. You know what wait, I'm saying? Wait, that makes no sense. So it no longer provides attack speed when cast, but it provides passive, passive. attack speed? What does that yeah. mean? So when when you dash, you get the attack speed, but now you, you just automatically have the attack speed. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I see you, I see you. And then Fields of Love? Fields of Love is uh, changes the ability, how it works with Love Struck, I guess. So Fields of Love now mezzes enemies for 1.5 seconds when activated within less than 8 hearts and max the hearts memorized to 3. Wasn't so was stun before, right? Like a complete stun? No, it was mez. It was always a mez? It was always a mez. What the heck? For some reason I keep thinking it was like an always a stun. I just like never <laughs> notice. Alright. <laughs> I'm good at the game. The right <laughs> so Cupid had a really nice buff added to him. Yeah. As long as you can like make sure those are like eight hearts, you're like you're golden. Your four one combo. That that's complete aids. He got like overall I think he got really nice buffs. Yeah. Um, it won't be game breaking, but it you know, won't it's be, like... but it's like pretty decent buffs. Fafnir, my turn. Fix Grindelwald Fafnir. Gryffindorf. Not having his laugh audio. Ooh. Mm. You can't uh -huh. spam laugh as Gryffindorf. Disgusting. Oh, no. <laughs> that's what I like to do. That's what I like right. to see. Alright. For Isis's wind gust, increase scaling from 30% per wind gust to 40. That's gonna, this... like, better her clear. Did, did I fucking. No. Was I fucking done? Hey, the last two gods I had, I had freaking <laughs> cosmetic or whatever changes. <laughs> General changes. G give me one thing. Alright, uh, you get this one thing. Alright, so basically it clears better. Done. Alright, X. Alright, Izanami. Izanami basic attack now deals 75% damage outgoing, 25 damage going in from 50 to 50. Base attack speed increased from 0.85 to 0.95. And the fade away, now is Nami, unlike before, is now invisible to minions when she begins channeling fade away. This means that her getaway is now better than it used to be. You know, we have a new Loki in the making. A new Al Kuang, actually. <laughs> a new everything. <laughs> Like this, I really liked the, these changes on her actually. Like the fade yeah. before, I was she watching got, it. She got a really good buff too. Yeah, the, on her that attack speed attacks. buff is really nice too. And her base attack buff, instead of 50 50, it's 75 25. It's really good. Yeah. Damage really going nice. out and then. I, think, I'm not, I don't think it's to be game breaking. It's probably more like along the lines of Cupid, how it's like. You know, it, it, it needed to be changed, you know? Yeah, yeah. Except with Izanami, I think it needed. It, she really needed those changes. Um. <laughs> Ooh, yay, Nemesis! Alright, she's getting a... What? A, a nerf? Alright, cool. Um, Discuss. So her Why would judgment, we... Judgment, which is an ult. <laughs> Why does she need a nerf? I don't know. Don't ask uh -oh. me. <laughs> Fucking wear bronze characters. We're bronze players. We don't know anything. <laughs> Shh, I'm silver 5, actually. Just kidding. Um, <laughs> so, this was really needed. Um, overall, she was kind of getting pretty broken. Not necessarily broken, but like... She was just wrecking if you she happened to catch you off guard, especially if you were a tank. She just divine judgment and you're dead. You're dead. Like just there's no getting around that. Um the Shaw. Windfire wheels. Update the presentation of the critical circles. <laughs> why do we need to, why do we need to know all these like cosmetic or general like I mean, okay, Absolutely. in terms of like as Izami, yes we need to know that. But for like Fafnir, like why do we need to know if his laugh was working or not? Like <laughs> <laughs> To be honest. Alright, so Raijin getting a little bit of a nerf. Um his reduced scaling on Thunder Crash and reduced damage on Raiju. Personally, I don't think it's enough. Um it doesn't I mean Thunder Crash, I think that's enough. But Raiju on the other hand, it's only like decreased by forty at max, so that still sounds like it's gonna hurt. A yeah. Ton. A it's ton. still like, we just had, <clears throat> we were just facing a Raijin, and he hurts a fuckload. 
And Raiju, Raiju just doesn't help at all. Like, that early game damage is disgusting. Early, early game damage, early game clear. Thunder Crash, I like to see. Other, But Raiju, that's, I don't think that's enough. Mm. Alright. Ratatasker. <coughs> Through the cosmos. Ratatasker will now go the proper distance. <laughs> and cancelling this ability at maximum range. <laughs> Fix the radius being listed incorrectly on the tooltip. <coughs> <coughs> Paradigm shifting changes right here, everybody. Yeah. Paradigm shifting. All right, Terra. Last but not least, fixed an issue where bonus damage was being calculated as true damage. That's a problem. Mm -hmm. It just goes shreds through your protections. Automatic time span. <laughs> Auto automatic right there. Crushing Earth no longer has a slow for enemies standing between the standing zones. All right. Monolith root duration decreased. And Terra's blessing cooldown cool down increase increased from 90 seconds to 110, 105, 195, 90 seconds. How I get the last word? Fuck you. Um, <laughs> I don't like a crushing earth. Personally, I, I prefer it with the whole slow thing. That kind of made Terra good. It was where you. That's, that's what they kind of like. When they had the god release, they sold her as. Alright, you can basically just like pick where opponents go and don't go. But without yeah. that slow, it's kind of like. <laughs> You can cut, you can semi take away, but yeah. you can't really take away. Yeah, it's like her her biggest selling point basically was the fact that she can block enemies out. But now it's like, why, why would you take this away from us? Yeah, uh, monolith. Yeah, that was kind of needed. That was kind of AIDS when you just you, got, you just got stuck there for ten hours. Um, Terra's blessing, cooldown increased. I don't like that. I I like it. I don't mind it. Uh, personally, I don't think Terra should have gotten nerfed. Well, okay, her monolith, yes, but her crushing mm. earth and her ult, I think they could have left that alone. I don't know, man. How triggered are you right now? On a scale of one, oh my god. On a scale of one through Fire Lord Najah. <laughs> I was right about to go play his like voice pack. Um, is that all? Do that we is thank basically all. Do we do we thank them for watching? Other than that, guys, please like, comment, and subscribe if you all did. And in the comment section below, please tell us... How triggered are you right now? Alright, just in case you didn't know, I, I just played the, the, the Naja thing. Anyways, hope you all enjoyed, and other than that, we will see you all next time. Peace. Delicious!